After a year of wearing masks and keeping our distance, some people skipped Christmas altogether last year. Families are expected to come together this Christmas to celebrate the holiday. But this all comes as the Omicron variant is spreading. Our Kathy Hernandez live outside the Houston Holocaust Museum this morning, the site of a vaccine clinic today with more on President Biden's plan to curb the spread of this variant. Kathy, good morning. Good morning to you. Health experts right now are urging everyone to get tested before Christmas. But as we've seen, that has become a challenge for many. People are tired, they're fatigued, they're burned out. Mental health has taken a toll or has taken a hit in the um, in the pandemic. Um, so all those things are sort of weighing on people. Another holiday season, another wave of COVID-19 as the Omicron variant rapidly spreads. Local experts say while it's too late to get the full protection from the vaccine for Christmas, they urge people get tested. If you're going to have elderly or at-risk people present, the most important thing everyone can do is to wake up Christmas morning and give yourself an at-home rapid COVID test. However, it's become difficult to get one of those at-home rapid tests. Store shelves are empty, including right here in Houston. I don't think anybody anticipated that this was going to be as rapidly spreading as it did. Next month, the administration plans to distribute 500 million at-home COVID tests to any American who wants one by mail for free. People would have to request a test online. The president is also deploying a thousand members of the military to help understaffed hospitals and opening new testing sites nationwide. And in addition to getting tested, doctors recommend people get their vaccinations and booster shots. Harris County Public Health is hosting a clinic today from 9 to 5. It's taking place here at the Holocaust Museum at 5401 Caroline Street. Today, they're offering the Pfizer vaccine. We reached out to stores here in Houston, including Walgreens and CVS, and they say they are working hard to restock the shelves of those at-home rapid tests. Meanwhile, we've just learned the president is set to have have a COVID update at 2 o'clock Houston time. Reporting live in the Museum District, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC 2 News.